The newer deep-toed imaging system descends from the ship Tangaroa to the seafloor. The vehicle is directed by scientists on the ship. The camera lights show deep sea skates and rat tails hovering over the soft sediments of the Chatham Rise. Bright orange brisingid starfish are common on the graveyard seamounts. Ghostly white deep sea sponges and small lacy hydrocorals. Honeycomb sponges on hard branching corals. And the greyfish is a giant lepidon cod. Orange Ruffy dart around the camera, stirring up the sediment. These coral provide a habitat for many deep sea animals. The laser pointers are set 20 centimeters apart. They're a guide to the size of the animals being filmed. Spiral gold coral on the seamounts of the Kermadec Arc. Hydrothermal vents occur here. Fluffy mats of white and orange bacteria grow around these active vents. Many vent barnacles live on the volcanic cone of the Brothers Seamount. Blind vent shrimps flit among their stalks. Moving through the chimney field of Brothers Seamount Volcano. Glass sponges, gorgonian bottle brush corals, and large anemones cover the basalt substrates of the Macquarie Ridge. Bubblegum corals are considered the kauri of the deep because they grow several meters high. Suspension feeding animals like these brittle stars and soft corals sift food particles out of the current. So many brittle stars inhabit the spot that scientists have called it Brittle Star City. Beyond the slopes of the Macquarie Ridge, the darkness of the abyss.